Greetings and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. Well, it's the end of summer, and when I wake up after sleeping, it will be autumn. So what did I do on day three? Well, I spent the night of day two into day three gathering and building. I built a couple of new things. I finished the food storage, and all of my food is currently there. I literally do not have any food on me, except, of course, for the potions of health. And you might notice that I'm actually very hungry, and I'm still hurt from the lynx attack, too. I'm also dirty. I'm guessing that's going to go away when I wake up. My bed is quite magical that way. So I also, of course, planted my cabbage, so we're going to be picking that. I got 20 of them down. That should be kind of interesting to see what we get from that. And, of course, our missions are going to change, our quests. So let's just take a look at this. Um... In the summer, of course, we took care of a couple of missions over here. We got a lot of dynasty reputation. As a matter of fact, that kicked us up to a maximum total of 10 buildings. Um, we tried these, but we really couldn't do them at this time. You know, I do have Unigost selected, so we do have that. But the other two, one wanted some uh, sewing materials or something. I mean, I didn't have anything, so I didn't bother taking it. The other guy wanted a bucket, and I had no way of getting a bucket I actually can get one now, but at the time I didn't, so there's not much I can do about it. If anybody asked me for a bucket now, I can do it. Uh, there was this mission down here, but we just never got down that way, right? So what I'm kind of hoping for, and the reason I'm going to hit F5 before sleeping, by the way, is that I want to make sure that I'm going to have missions available to me, right? When I Go to sleep and wake up. This is all going to get reset, except, of course, for the structured ones like Unigaz, right? I think Al win too. I have to go back and talk to him, even though I was supposed to do it in the summer. I'm sure he's not going to say no to me, though. So the thing is, if there's only like two or three and maybe they're down here or something like that, because how do I even get down there? I guess I have to get a mount to get down there or something, because, I mean, this was a long trip. This and back took, a, like, the day, you know what I mean? So, I mean, unless I had something in the middle here, I mean, I do have to set up other little villages, too. But, I mean, this just seems like a very long trip down here, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. So I'm just going to stick in this area for now. So if the, if the quests are not good, I'm going to do a reload. That's what I'm talking about. Because it's kind of very important that you get dynasty reputation. And I can't throw away an entire season. I could see, though, that if the season was longer than three days, you might be able to make it down there. Yeah, I mean, I kind of felt that three days wasn't going to be good, but, I mean, I didn't know the game, so I didn't want to increase it, if you know what I mean. Because, look, just going down to Gastonia to see uh, Unigas and his wife, that basically took the whole day. Mind you, I did stop for straw, but, I mean, it is a lot of a time to go down there. If the days were longer... That'd be good. I wouldn't even mind if the nights were longer because I work through my nights. Uh, we won't be working through this night, though. So, like I said, I have no food on me because it's actually in the completed food storage. So, I'm interested to see how it degrades there. Anyway, it's time to sleep. I'm going to put this out because why would I want to sleep with that in my hand, right? All right, so let's see how this works out as we go into autumn. All right, and we're up. First thing I'm going to look at is this. Okay, so we have a mission. We have we have two missions over here, and we have one over here. And we wow! There's two down here, and there's two over here. Wow, that is that's amazing. Okay, so look within our neighborhood here, we have one, two, three. Four, five. So, yeah, that worked out really good right there. Yep, yep, we're, we're keeping that. We're keeping that. Okay, so let's uh, experience autumn. Yeah, you can see that the colors changed, didn't it? It's not like green anymore. It's kind of like a uh, yellowish orange here. Very nice, very nice indeed. Oh, the cabbage is done. Okay, so we don't need anything, do we? No, I can just collect it. Okay, and it does the whole field. Okay, uh, I got nine and one seed. Oh, I got my seeds back? Okay, let's just grab it all very quickly. I did 20 of them, right? 
Okay, and apparently I just unlocked the well. All right, so let's grab all this. So even though there are four of them, you're doing the whole plot at one time, right? All right. And we can do something with this as soon as I get some meat. All right, let's see here, all the way over here. We'll, we'll take a look at how much we got when it's done. Even though there is a total, I'm just avoiding the total because I want to be surprised here, right? All right, let's see. Is it? Okay, a little bit more there. All right. All right, now I have to replow these fields, even though they look like they still have cabbage in them. Uh, basically, they're back to scratch. You can see unplowed requires fertilizer, so I'm going to have to do fertilizer. Here's the thing. I'm not planting anything in autumn. The only things I could plant in autumn would be rye and wheat. And since I don't need animal feed and I'm not doing any baking, then I'm just going to wait until winter. In winter, I can plant carrots. The carrots, though, won't be ready until summer. So I'm going to have to make another row one way or another. I'll either plant the carrots here or I'll make another row over there or when I get back to it, you know, for the flax. Which, by the way, I never sold my flax. So I might want to make kind of a thread out of them or I might want to hold on to them someday so I can actually sell them when I need money. All right, so we have everything. So let's take a look at what we got here. All right, so food. 173 and there's seven food each wow okay what about 35 seeds i i did that with 20 seeds and i got 35 that's all kinds of awesome all right so let's go over to food storage and store our cabbage actually i'm overweight because of the cabbage ain't i it's the reason i'm moving so slowly Okay, so you can see this is done. You know, this thing was actually kind of nasty because those individual segments up there and the ones in the back each needed four logs. So I needed four logs for that. I needed four logs for that one, four logs for that one. So I'm like, you got to be kidding me. And also you had to do some logs for the inside, but nowhere near as bad. All right, so how did... Okay, the berries did very well. 87.5%, not bad at all. Okay, even just the uncooked meat, 87.5. And I still have the uh, meat and gravy on me, by the way. I should probably grab that. Salted meat, wow, 91.2. That really did well, didn't it? All right, so let's load the cabbage, which weighs 30, like nearly 35 kilograms. Wow, that's amazing. All right, so that's going to be very useful. Oh, one more. There we go. Okay, so that's going to be very useful. All right, so it'll last here. Now, there is something I can make, but at the moment, I only have one meat. Um, I have to go over here, right? Yeah, because there's two missions over there. If one of them is Night Hunt, I can't do it. Just saying. Um, all right, so I do have two other buildings over here. I believe this is the woodshed. What this allows you to do is, of course, I do have a log on me, right? All right. So you take a log and it will turn it into two planks. What does this one do? Oh, firewood. Right, right. See, if you have um, if you have villagers, you have to give them food, you have to give them water, and you also have to uh, get them firewood. That way they can keep themselves warm at night. Otherwise, they're going to use logs or, or they'll just be unhappy and leave, you know? So you kind of have to do that. All right, we're going to... I got one log on me. We're going to turn it into planks. So that's basically the entire purpose of this. But believe me, it really wasn't hard to make. The big investment, I think, was six to put it down. All right, so then we're out of there. And there's a little bit of storage there if you want to put something in it, but that's not really something. All right, this also really wasn't uh, something that required a lot of uh, resources. It's certainly not as much as a house or certainly not as much as that storage over there. Uh, this, I believe, is it telling you here? Yeah, workshop one. Workshop one. All right. It also has a little bit of storage there. What this does is allows you to make wood things. Also, you can make uh, wicker baskets. See, this is bucket. If I had had this available to me, I could have done that guy's mission down below and I could have gotten some easy dynasty experience. You might notice that vials is unlocked. Well, that's because there was kind of a money-making thing. I only got a chance to use it once. Uh, it has been fixed. There was an update today. You might notice on the side, on the upper right there, 
not only do we have the mission for Unigos story, we also have a um, the chapter mission up there where I have to kill boars or foxes. That was part of the update too. So they changed a whole bunch of things. They nerfed the bejeebas out of this. See, look, for one plank, I could get 10 vials, right? The vials individually used to sell for 15. Well, actually, they were worth 15. They would sell for 7.5, which means one log would get you 150 coins. So obviously, they nerfed that. It's not 15 anymore. It's three. So obviously, it's a lot more reasonable because, I mean, that was, I only got a chance to do it once myself, but uh, yeah, I did unlock it. But, you know, the thing about it is for potions, it's going to be necessary. Um, here's something I do believe I need to get. Actually, one, I need a log for that. I'm going to need the bucket too, because the thing is that uh, it's a source of water. All right, hold on a second. We're going to have to do this anyway, so I'm going to do it right now. All right, so I'm going to, I have two planks on me. I'm going to make a bucket. All right, I can't make the bowls right now anyway because I need a log. Apparently, you don't make them from uh, planks. All right, so here is what I have right now. The bucket. I'm going to put the bucket into the five hole. All right, so this is what you do with a bucket. I know that sounds weird, but here we go. All right, so let's go to five, and then it says fill bucket. All right, so let's just fill the bucket all the way up. All right, and then I'm going to drink because apparently I'm a little bit thirsty. All right, let's take a look at the bucket now. The bucket is no longer in my tools because the bucket is now here. You notice bucket of water, 10 of 10. See, the thing is that that is now something you would put in your food storage in case your villagers wanted water. See, they're not going to go to the brook. You have to provide those things for them. So we're just going to take the bucket and put it over there. All right, so it's over here now. So if somebody, if I had a villager, they would have stuff over there now. All right, so I'd like to make some stuff, but at the moment, I don't have it available to me. So what we're going to do, do I, what do I have on me? I know I put some things down. I have the bow. I have the stone arrows too. I have the bronze pickaxe. That's because I was doing some last-minute cleaning in there. I actually have quite a lot of uh, stone and copper. Copper. I have 61 copper. Iron. I still have that iron. I didn't get that from the cave. I think you have to go somewhere else. Um, I used a lot of my salt. I don't think you... I don't know if you noticed. I had a lot. I have like 21 salted meat that were sitting in there. Um, I still have some more salt. Stone, I have 109 stone. Tin, I have 35. So a smithy would be great. I'm going to have to do some like building or manufacturing, you know, with my hands or something like that because I do need to get there. Oh, technology. Oh, the farming, right. I got the well. Right, right. I can make a well now. All right, that's something. Uh, actually, it's this one because I have to get to smithy which means I have to like make things in my hands. I could make a lot of stone knives. I'm guessing that's still good. It wasn't mentioned in the patch notes, by the way. All right, so let's go over to this town here and see about the two missions they have. I'm hoping that one of them is not Night Hunt because Night Hunt was very unpleasant. Let's see here. I also need to start thinking about a prospective wife, so I may be checking out the neighbors, if you know what I mean. All right, let's see. Of course, they, okay, uh, you... Okay, they have to have that little person icon. Besides, she does look kind of old, doesn't she? Yeah, she does. Okay, redheads, watch out for the redheads. Uh, but of course, she doesn't have the little person icon. The person icon means that they can be recruited. He cannot be recruited. Okay. Where are the missions, by the way? Okay, so I could recruit him. Let's take a look at him. Um, they're, they're kind of mixing together. He's got twos and ones. No. Okay, Amelia. Let me How talk to I Amelia for a moment. She's 28. You're really old. Remember, I'm 18. Day. But let's just take a quick look. Okay, she's... Good at, what's that last one? 
Oh, oh, that's like a workshop one. No, no, absolutely not. What about you here? Hold on a minute. You're three in diplomacy. Why do I need that? I can't even imagine why I would need that. Okay, do you, are you a mission person? Yes, you are. All right, I'm going to hit the F5, by the way, just in case. I welcome oh. you, traveler. Yeah, sorry about that. I didn't mean to do that. All right, can I help you with something? Do you think you're a better woodcutter than I am? Prove it. Let's see if you can gather more lods than me in an hour. Uh, we win for 50 coins. Winner take all. All right, well, I'm going to go chop down some trees. All right, I'm in. All right, um, hold on a minute. Let's select the mission so I know exactly what I'm doing here. Okay, seven logs. Okay, could get rid of that. All right, seven. Go right for the maple. <laughs> Don't waste your time on the birch. Because the birch will give me two, the maple will give me eight, uh, four. So all I need is two of these. Okay, uh, give me that, give me that, give me that, give me that. All right, uh, another maple. All right, couldn't possibly do it quicker than this, right? All right. All right, give me, give me, give me, give me. All right, that's eight. He wanted seven. Easy 50 coins. Look, he didn't even go anywhere. Okay, thank you. I'm always ready to learn. Okay, so he, ga oh, he gave me 100. And he gave me some destiny exp Pardon me, I keep saying destiny. Dynasty experience. All right, so let's just uh, check the management thing out. Okay, I'm nearly up to uh, 600 here. All right, that's very good. Uh, do I still have those? No, he took them. Okay, that's fine. I guess maybe in a way he bought them. All right, so where is the other mission? All right, so let's see what this fella has. It's nice to meet you. Uh, can I help you with something? I can actually use your help. I'm thinking of expanding my field, but there's a lot of trees in the area. Could you cut down some for me? Yeah, sure, I can do that. Absolutely. Okay, what does he want? He wants me to cut down 10 trees. Uh, so I'm going to uh, do that over the season. I'm certainly not doing that right now. Okay, so the thing is that that's actually going to give me farming technology as well as dynasty reputation. But as long as I do that before autumn is done, because I'm certainly going to cut down enough trees, right? Okay, why are you standing over there? Alice? Hmm, interesting. Okay, so there is something else I need to do. If you look at the uh, the top there, right? Um, hunt boars, hunt uh, foxes. So I'm thinking what we can do is we can go in here and see if we can find something, right? With ho Hopefully without getting hurt. You know, I should probably... Can I make a... Hold on, let me just see. Can I make a spear? What I really should have done, I can. What I really should have done is I should have unlocked the stone spear. Because the thing is that that would probably do a lot more damage. Alright, uh, we'll put that... Alright, you know what? I'm going to put that right there just so I have access to it. Right? Because if something comes in my face, this is the best thing. I've learned that it's really hard to actually shoot when... Oh, 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 yeah, right. Mushrooms. I guess... Uh, I guess in the autumn, that's when they really pop up. Look, there's another one. Because there's actually a, um, a soup that requires a bunch of different kinds of mushrooms. Okay, we got some more over here. No, those are rocks, actually. Lots of rocks. Okay. All right, so let's pick a road over here. Okay, I see more. I actually want to lead with the bow here in case we run into it. All right. I would much rather hunt foxes than boars, but I have a feeling that they would be hard to actually hit 
being that they're foxes, you know what I mean? All right, let's see what we got over here. All right, am I hitting the right way? Yeah, that's it. That's where I want to go. All right, so let's just keep our eyes open. I'm guessing that this would be a lot easier in the winter because we would be able to see things a little bit better, right? Okay, I guess that's clay over there. All right. And we have a sign. Oh, I see a boar. Is that a boar? Because that's a big boar. That's a very big boar. Anything over here? What, what, what's that? Okay, that looks like a lynx. Myth. Okay, I think I spooked it. What's that? That's another one. Okay, I got to get that out of my hands. I'm losing stamina. Is That looks like a fox. But you can see what I mean. They move a little bit quick, don't they? All right, well, I do see a boar. And I'm... Okay, what was that? Oh, is he running back? Could you just stop running so I could shoot you? Did you just scare the... Did he just scare the boar? Uh-oh. Is he aggroing? Uh-oh. Uh, are you coming after me? Okay. Uh-oh. Um... Oh, there's multiples! I didn't see that! Okay, I'm in trouble! Running! Screaming! Okay, um, not what I was thinking I wanted to do. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, right there. All right. Yeah, I know. This is crazy. But you know what? Got to do it, right? I missed him. Okay. He turned and he ran. He's bleeding. Okay, is he's bleeding? Got him. Okay, let's hope the other one isn't upset by that. Okay, only eight meat. That's, okay, what was that? That's a birch tree. Okay, that's unusual. Only got eight meat from that. I mean, that's a big animal there. Okay, well, if that's what it is, that's what it is, right? All right, where's the other one? There he is. All right. Um, oh, no, way off, way off, way off, way off. Not even lined up properly. Okay, right there. Ooh, two shots. Two shots. So you hit him from behind. Okay, and let's get the other one. I'll get the arrow when I get my stuff. Okay, another eight meat. All right, that's good. Well, for me, not for him, right? All right, what do we got? Okay, there's the lynx. There's another one in the background. All right. So the boars seem to be in this area. At least two of them were. Yep, 
if I could do that mission, that'll get me a bunch of uh, dynasty experience. And that is what I want. All right, let's grab some more of these. Of course, I don't want to wander into a bear or get too close to a bison, though, right? I also don't want to get surrounded by boars. That would be a problem. If they'd both attack me at one time, I would have been in a lot of trouble. Of course, a very convenient fox would be nice. I don't see anything around here now. All right, where am I? All right, let's head back. I mean, I did see foxes. Oh, is that, what is that? I missed it, and it didn't make any noise. Yeah, that's... What is that? Oh, is that a rabbit? All right, you know what? It's a rabbit. I can catch rabbits all the time. I don't really care about a rabbit. It doesn't help me any. All right. Oh, 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 I got some more. Is there anything more? Oh, there's some more here. Okay, I think that's a new one. Hold on a minute. Any more of those? I don't see any. Well, I mean, if you're just going to sit there, I'm going to shoot you. You know what I mean? It's, it's basically to help your species because you're pretty dumb if you're just standing in front of me because I probably smell of blood. Just saying. All right, so where are we now? All right, let's move down here to this intersection up here and see if we can find something. I mean, I can get it later, but I mean, I do have to eventually get it. I wouldn't mind moving that on right now. Like I said, I'll take a... Um, I'll take a fox if I can get one, right? Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Just no bears, please. No bears. Oh, water. I actually need some water. So why don't we do that? Okay. So let's see. Oh, oh there's a fox. Okay, I'm hiding. Put it there. Stay right there. Yes! 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 Not so much for you, but for me. And I don't think he said anything except yeep. Okay, so I got six meat from him. I got my arrow back, which is very important, of course. Um, all right, let's see. How did I do with that? All right, so I now have nearly 750 Dynasty experience. So what is my current mission for them? A farm. Okay, make a wooden hoe and a simple bag. My limit will go up to 20 for that? I mean, I literally can do that right now because I just got leather. Okay, so what do we got here? Hunting knowledge. Yeah, we're going to go hunting knowledge. Because uh, the experience will get in there faster there, right? I mean, I think I can literally do that right now. I do have leather on me, right? Where is leather? Yeah, I just got the leather from those guys. So I can make a simple bag. Where is it? Q handheld. Simple bag. Three leather. I'm going to need it anyway eventually, right? Okay, and I have to make a hoe. That means I have to cut down a tree. All right, let's grab a couple more of these. Give me that. Actually, I have a lot of those, so I don't really need any more of those. All right. Uh, how much meat do I have? 22. Okay, so I think we can make some stuff with that. Um, dropping deer is obviously the best thing we can do. But, oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. That's interesting. All right, so what do you got? Uh, sticks, probably not what I'm supposed to be looking for. Okay, I see wool fabric and sticks. 
I mean, is there anything else around here? There's usually two things. Sticks. What? Okay, there's also bronze bolts. And I, I'm looking at an iron knife. Was that 100%? No, it's 75%. It's still better than my copper, though, which I also found, by the way. Okay, is there anything else hiding in there? Hold on a minute. Because I saw bronze bolts. What is this? A crudulin. Okay, that's just a club, though, right? All right, that one actually had a lot of things in it. Usually, they only have, like, two things in it. Here, give me the sticks, just in case you're hiding something from me. Okay, that was actually a very useful... Um, a very useful card over there. Okay, they did say in the update notes that they added a bunch of new carts and stuff. Well, yeah, little secret things. They added a bunch more of them. But I kind of thought you'd have to do a new map. But then that may have been there already. I don't know. Maybe they did put them into new maps and such like that. All right, now that everybody is gathered around here. Okay, you know... I mean, I could hire you, but, you know, I'm not thinking in terms of uh, the big picture there, you know? Amelia, you have... Yeah, I mean, you're good in the workshop. You're also, I think, 28. Okay. I'm just, I'm just doing some wife shopping here. Just don't pay no attention to me. And I'm pretty sure she was the old one. All right, uh, she's a merchant, so she's not going anywhere. Okay, well, you know what? Uh, I, there are other towns, right? Would you like to come home with me? Wait a minute, okay, collect. It's actually looking at the thing underneath him, so I was like, collect? What? All right, so let's head on back. Oh, that's right, I wanted to get a hoe, which means I'm gonna actually take a tree with me. Um, do we have a maple? Yeah, because the maple is... Oh, you know what it is? I don't have that uh, equipped, do I? Where is my stone axe? We'll put that in the first hole there. There we go. I'm sure they won't mind. Yeah, maples always have um, four logs. And then boom, and then boom. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, where would the other one go? There it is. Four. All right. I should be able to make the hoe. Okay. So I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Does this mean I did the mission? Okay. Merchant locations. There are many specialized merchants scattered. Yeah, I, I know that already. Okay. Hold on a minute. I'm confused. Okay. Now it wants me to plant stuff. Okay, fertilizer. I think I have 15 fertilizer, but it wants me to have carrot seeds and wheat grain. All right, so I guess I'm going to have to go buy that. And that will give me the 20. I'm guessing maybe, I don't know if it's going to be done after that. Which way is home? This way is home. All right, now that I have some meat, I want to try something. But in order to do that, I'm going to need bowls. But then again, I do have the logs now for that, right? So let's just very quickly do this. Sorry it's dark, but then again, it is nighttime, right? All right, let me get some, uh, let me get some stuff back here. All right, so I'm not gonna be making planks because this didn't want planks. All right, so let's see, workbench. Right, bowls. I need those for cooking, right? So let's just, uh, I think one will do the job, so I'm just going to click. I'm, well, I have to unlock it. Uh, it costs 100, and then I'm going to click on it. All right, so I can't do it with a torch in my hand, right? Okay, there we go. So I have some bowls. I think I had an extra one from the, um, the food that What's-Her-Name gave me. All right, I need the cabbage now. Well, I don't need all the cabbage. I need some of the cabbage. So well, I think... I think uh, 20 will do the job, and 21 will just take that for now, right? All right. Because apparently there's a food you can make 
that's actually pretty good, and it is meat, and it is cabbage. All right, so let's light this up. All right, instead of going down here, I'm going to the cauldron. All right, and I think it's a soup. All right, so potage. Okay, there's two of them. All right, I'm looking at pottage. It's two cabbage. That's salted meat. That's regular meat. I guess it's two ways to get to the same recipe. I mean, do I have to unlock each one of them? Or also, where is... Okay, so this was the mushroom soup. I still don't have... Oh, I don't have one of the mushrooms. Uh, then I would need salted meat. Just one, though. I think that's mostly water, but it does have some food in it, too. It's also only uh, 25 to unlock, where are these guys... All right. I'm wondering if one is going to unlock both of them. So let's find out. It did unlock both of them, but I just don't have any salted meat on me. Okay, so this takes two cabbage and three meat. Um, can I make five? Yes, I can. Because I have five bowls. Now, as I understand, this stuff is actually pretty good. And this is the kind of thing that you'd put into food storage so that your people could actually eat it. They're not going to eat raw meat. And, uh, okay, there we go. All right, so let's see what we have here. Uh, the, the, the inventory, food, and pottage. All right, so that's 30 food and 10 water. So that's actually a pretty darn good meal right there. I think it's kind of borderline, though. I mean, if you're looking at the raw meat, you can't eat the raw meat. If you were to roast the raw meat, though, um, it's six each. So that would be 18 for three of them. And then the cabbage, it's two cabbage. So that would be seven each. Would be, you know, it's kind of close, but it is an all-in-one little thing. And you do get the bowl back, right? All right. So what I'm going to do, actually, I'm kind of hungry. Maybe I should eat one of them myself, right? I, I do have to put the rest of the meat away and the cabbage away. Um, do I have anything else? I have to put the meat away. All right, so why don't I just take, um, where is it here? I'll just take one of these myself. All right, so that actually filled me up pretty well. All right, for now, I'm going to put it in here because I am, well, not in there. I'm going to put it in here because this is food storage. All right. All right, and food, put all that cabbage away. Yeah, I got a lot of cabbage from 20 plots. Can you imagine if I planted the 30? Wow. Well, I can do that now because I got 35 seeds. Um, am I still carrying those seeds? I think I am. All right. Let's put the meat in here. And I'm going to hold on to that. I'll, I'll put one in there. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll split the difference. I'll, I'll keep one of them. I'll keep two of them, I should say. All right. And I'm going to put the, uh, the mushrooms in here, too. Because technically they're food. And I don't want them to rot too quickly. I still have the seeds. Yeah, I still have the seeds. I have to do something about that. Um, let's put the fur in here. No, not in here. It goes in the other place. Anyway, I think that's going to be it. Um, well, autumn is here. And we have uh, we've been very productive. We advanced our, uh, our mission up there. We got out of Chapter 4. We've been to Chapter 5 now. Uh, we killed some boars and we killed a wolf. Um, like I said, I think it'd probably be easier to hunt during the winter because everything would be white and you'd see the creatures walking on there. You know what I mean? Of course, that might bring bears down or something. We also got an iron what? An iron knife. Uh, what about the other one? We got something else too, didn't we? Yeah, I, I think that's just a club. I'm going to put that in there because, I mean, I don't know why I'd want a club. I'd probably want a, uh, a spear. Okay, put the feathers in there. Uh, actually, I used the seeds in the one in the closet, right? Uh, in, in my house. All right, put that in there. All right, I got a lot of sticks. I don't need the sticks. I mean, I need them, but I don't want them here. And of course, the... Oh, wow, that actually sells a lot. Why is the condition of wool fabric bad? I, I have no idea. I, I don't have any idea about that. And I'm still carrying some straw, too. And put the leather away. I mean, this is what it's all about, right? This is the storage in here, right? I'll hold on to the logs. I'll put the cabbage in the uh, in my house. So I think that's going to be it for now. 
So right into autumn, I took care of a couple of missions. Well, I took care of one mission. The other mission, of course, is waiting for uh, me to chop down a lot of trees. But I'm going to do that anyway. So as long as I do it in autumn, it shouldn't be a problem. I do have to go down to Gastonia and see about missions down there. Maybe we'll do that in the next episode. And uh, then I actually do need to uh, buy some extra seed. I have to get the carrot. I wanted to do that anyway because I want to plant carrot in the winter. And uh, what was the other one? It wanted uh, wheat, I think it was. Maybe I should just plant it anyway. I mean, my uh, farm isn't sitting there doing anything. And if they're going to make me buy it, maybe they're going to make me plant it. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See you.